Hey, what is up, YouTube? It's Jason back here again with another video. And today, for you guys, I got another episode of Get It or Forget It. And today's episode, well, I forgot to say, without further ado, let's get into the shoe. Because that's going to be my new catchphrase. Nobody steal it. Um, so, today's episode is going to be on the Nike Barkley Post Sight Mac, Max. Nike, Nike Barkley Post Sight. Post Sight. Sounds weird saying that. It's the first time I've ever said that word, honestly. Post Sight Max. Um, yeah. The, yeah. Uh, I'll just get into the shoe because I'm, I'm bugging myself out. The official colorway is purple and team orange. They will be released on May 18th with a whole bunch of other great sneakers. And they will retail for $235. If you didn't hear me, $235. If you're still astounded by this number, I'm going to say it one more time. $235. And for people that still didn't hear me, I'm going to say it one last time. $235 for these Barclays. Charles Barr, let, let's 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 begin. Charles Barkley um, was an amazing basketball player, um, amazing, amazing, amazing basketball player. He was, uh, you know, un unfortunately he wasn't able to, you know, win any championships, but he was an amazing player. You know, on the dream, he was on the dream team with Jordan, Magic, you know, and Larry Bird and all those other guys. And he was the leading scorer, so you know, he was top dog really on that team. He won MV, he won an MVP during. Michael Jordan's, you know, during his three peats, he was it was him and Karl Malone were the only two guys that won MVPs during his, you know, championship era. And um he so he was a he was an amazing, amazing, amazing player. And um great character, um, you know, great personality. I've w i love watching him on TNT and stuff like that. But your sneakers, man, are I I mean, I don't even like them, honestly. And then the price just makes them uglier. Like, I, I, I want you guys to leave a comment below. Does, do, does that also happen to you too? Like, you see something, like, it's, like, it's all right, but then you hear the price for it and it's outrageous and you're just like, yeah, it's freaking ugly now. Like, if the price is not right for me, something becomes ugly. If this was $150, I'd be like, all right, you know, it's a, you know, it's a pretty nice sneaker. $235, this is the ugliest sneaker I've ever seen in my life. Well, this isn't the ugliest sneaker I've ever seen in my life. I've definitely seen worse, but this is probably top 20 because, I mean, they're not really that ugly, but I'm more, I'm being biased because of the price because that's an outrageous price for me. For other people, you know, they might be able to be able to afford it. They're like, oh, you know, that's something. It's not a lot or whatever. But for me, it's like 235. Like, I don't, I really don't understand what Nike is doing. Their marketing team is doing um, whoever, if it, even if it's not marketing, I don't know, whoever is in, you know, that little cubicle making these price, coming up with these prices, like, do they have, like, I really believe that they literally have, like, um, I don't know, like a ticket spinner that, you know, you put a whole bunch of numbers and you spin it, and whatever number they pick out, that's what they price a shoe at, honestly, that's what I'm believing that they're starting to do, because these prices are just outrageous. Um, I, I, I don't see any reason at all to price these at $235. I believe there are a general release, but I honestly don't know, and I honestly do not care to do the research because I'm, you know, I know I shouldn't be doing the research because it's for you guys. I'm trying to inform you guys, but it's just like it's outrageous. I wouldn't recommend anybody paying two hundred and thirty-five dollars for these. I mean, if you do like them, you know, let me not say that because you know there's people out there that do like them. I'm just, I'm just entitling my opinion, guys. Don't take offense to it if I say this. The sneakers ugly. It doesn't mean you have bad taste. Maybe I have bad taste for not liking the sneakers. So I don't want to. I'm not trying to offend anybody offend anybody or anything i hope when you come into watching these videos you know it is strictly my opinion um and you know all that kind of stuff i'm not trying to say you know it's not it's basically my opinion really um back to the shoe it's extremely ugly i will i won't, I won't buy it honest i'm not buying it you know because like i said in my previous get it or forget it episode and if you haven't seen that click on the link on the screen to just check it out after you finish watching this of course because i'm in the middle of a conversation and that would well, it's not really a conversation. Yeah, it is a conversation. Come talking to you guys. I'm in the middle of a conversation, and that is very rude. But um, like I said, um, on the 18th, I will be copping the Phoenix Suns 8, so I will not have enough money to buy these. And even if I did have the money, I would not buy these. Um, and that that's pretty much it, guys. Um, you know, they and it's basically um, the colors kind of came based off of like you know the purple and orange. He used to play for the Suns, and that's the the Phoenix Suns colorway so it's basically to pay like tribute to, to Charles Barkley and all his you know and basically just, just to pay homage to him and what he did for the Phoenix Suns because after he left it just, it just well it didn't really go downhill because Steve Nash and Amari Stoudemire were great basketball players and they did they did do pretty good things with the Phoenix Suns but 
now it's just like Phoenix Suns who? Like you feel me? Um, I'm sorry for talking about getting into basketball. You guys probably hopefully I'm I hope whoever's watching this is into basketball like I am. Um, I mean most likely you are though. I don't know. I should look up that statistic. But um, that's pretty much it, guys. This video is running pretty long. Um, I like I said, I will not be copying these. I'm definitely gonna forget them. I don't even want to remember it. I don't even want to look at these anymore. It's just ridiculous. The price. I don't. Oh, I don't mind looking at the sneaker. It's the price that I don't mind looking at. It's just out. I'll just. It's just outrageous to me, honestly. Not getting their prices. It's just getting worse and worse. Cause just imagine <clears throat> if they're doing this now. Imagine in the next five years. <clears throat> excuse me. Imagine in the next five years. It's not like we're gonna stop liking sneakers. I know I'm gonna be a grown man still. Still probably wearing Jordans, you know, still probably wearing Nikes, you know. And it's like, in the next five years, we're probably going to be paying 250 re regular for Jordans. Imagine when Bar another pair of Barkers come out, it's going to be like $400. And it's like, it's not like our, our jobs are paying, well, I don't have a job, but you know, it's not like jobs are paying more as, you know, the cost of living rises. You don't get paid extra, you know, as the cost of living rises. So it's like, you're going to have to compromise. And, you know, that's a whole different other video. But just it's just something to think about. If they're doing this right now, Imagine in the next five years, even in the next two years, two years, even the next, you know, couple months, what will, will they keep raising these prices? And um, I probably should do a video on that, just talking about that. Um, like the video if, if you think, or leave a comment if you think I should do that. But I'm going to end this episode, guys, before I get emotional. <laughs> um, like I said, guys, leave a comment below, guys, will you be copping these? Why or why not? Or you can definitely hit me in my inbox and we can chat it up. Um, all my links will be in the description below my Twitter my website follow me on Twitter I need more Twitter followers uh, and um, if you haven't seen my previous ep episode of get it or forget it like I said you can click the link on the screen and um, it'll send you right there and um, if you haven't subscribed if you're a new viewer welcome like I always say and definitely hit that subscribe button because it is free I won't charge you and um, you get to see me in your subscription feed for the rest of your life it's just it's just an amazing thing it's, come on who doesn't want to see this beautiful face all the time man but um that's pretty much it for this episode guys and um i'll see you in the next video 235 dollars if you didn't hear me before 235 dollars guys jason out